St. Louis Police Department wants to cut down on car accidents in the city, and it has a new plan to solve the problem. Five on Your Side's Pepper Baker has more on the new initiative to make streets safer. Steve Swartz looks out from his wife's coffee shop on the corner of Washington Avenue and 4th Street at the exact moment a car turned the wrong way down a one-way. Accident-wise, we generally see people running red lights and not paying attention. We also see a number of people that turn the wrong way on the 4th Street being a one-way street and going the wrong way. This intersection is just one problem area police recognized. Each captain from the city's six districts picked three high accident locations within their boundaries and the traffic division provided three locations on area highways as well. And we've noticed that the fatalities increased and that the probable contributing, contributing circumstances for these crashes was speeding in about 40% of the cases. Lieutenant Paul Lauer says with less people on the roads during the pandemic, they're seeing drivers speed more. They've handled over 250 fatal crashes since 2018 across the city. 65 of those involved pedestrians. We're, we're out there trying to get, you know, hazardous violations, mostly speeding, but also, you know, improper passing, following too close those types of violations that we know contribute to crashes. You can expect to see more patrols on highways 64 and 70. Officers are focused on moving violations like running stop signs, red lights and speeding. Swartz supports whatever it takes to make it safer. Police in the street department do a great job of keeping things up, um, but things can definitely be better and we look forward to see what changes they may put in place. In St. Louis, Pepper Baker, five on your side. You can see a full list of those high accident locations at KSDK.com.